Hey, what's up everyone? Xover here and in today's video I want to do a video on the Terret 2 axis brushless gimbal for the GoPro. I've had this for a while, just haven't had the chance to test it out or assemble it or make a video of it, so I finally decided to do it. I will be using this on a QAV400. I don't know if you guys saw my last video, but I built that QAV400 specifically for a brushless gimbal. Overall, instructions were nice and clear. I didn't have any problems assembling them, assembling the gimbal, or reading the instructions. Everything was nice and clear. I think they did a great job on that. And like I said, assembly was fairly simple. Um, I honestly didn't really have to look at the directions. It's just common sense stuff. And here, if you're going to put on the QAV400, I suggest you get these. Uh, these are made out of wood. They just replace the carbon fiber ones. You can get them at a local Walmart or Target, stuff like that. And that's how it looks on the QAV400. It's hard mounted. As you can see, it works really well. The reason I decided to do a hard mount is because the QAV already does a great job eliminating vibrations. So I didn't feel the need to add the little vibration dampeners. So there's a tilt control. As you can see, it works really well. It comes back to position nicely. And here's some flight footage so you guys can see the performance of this gimbal. So that was it guys, the Terra 2 axis brushless gimbal. Let me tell you guys, I'm really happy with this brushless gimbal. Um, I know I'm going to get this question asked and I'll answer it right now. All the settings on the brushless gimbal are stock. I haven't hooked it up to the computer and messed with the settings. The tilt was a plug and play, I just connected the wires and it started working automatically, which is really nice. And that's one thing I really liked about this gimbal, I didn't have to mess with the settings, it was plug and play out of the box. And I can't wait to start shooting videos with it. And overall, I'm really happy with this gimbal. I've been using it for two weeks. And it's been working great. Haven't had any problems. So that's it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and hope it was helpful. And please subscribe if you haven't and like this video. And thanks for watching, guys.